Um, I'm not actually up to date with my Ralph floor, so I'm going to read this post uh, blind. Grandma to get my notes together. This is the last minute edition. Ralph is auctioning his sobriety, according to Pork Wellington, uh, and chat isn't happy. Ralph originally had to deal with a pay pig, $50, and he'd take a shot. Ralph got the $50, did not have alcohol on hand, and thought he could dance it off to some song. Pay Pig wasn't happy with that. Ralph said, I haven't taken that many Xanax today, and so I would take one bar that wouldn't hurt. Chat overwhelmingly did not want him to take pills. Ralph decided to Jew the Pay Pig further. The Pay Pig pays an additional $75, and Ralph will go to the liquor store and take a shot on stream when he gets back. If the pay pig didn't pay the additional $75, he was not going to take the original shot. So basically, he'd scam the guy out of $50. Chat isn't happy. Austin A. Bear says, the pills fuck you up. Um, Eula the one says, the funk is when you drink, dude. Leviathan163 says, no, you need alcohol in hand before donos, otherwise scam. Kirik says, we doing shot shows now. And you law, the one says, no one wants to see you drunk, dude. The show is way better when you are sober. Straight fucking ace. Black guy shrugging emoji. Last advice. Uh, this is Ralph holding up his Xanny box. Um, or Pisalpra. I don't know what that is. I guess that's Xanax. And also showing the uh, Swervo, Swervo, Swervo Dictional. which says, I do everything here. My legal prescriptions. And they do encourage me to wash them down. Left Mao, never change. Uh, so Ralph, officially off the wagon. Now he could take this and look at this and say, man, I'm off the wagon. Let me just stay off the wagon. So much nicer to be drunk and high off the wagon. And after all, I got them whamming in the family coats, fucking with me and shit. I could get back on the wagon. It's like Sisyphus shot. Yeah. Oh, boulder rolled downhill. What do I do? Oh, I guess I'll just drink and get high and stay at the bottom of the mountain. Never roll the boulder up the hill again. Oh, possible. He's something for a lane. Oh, that's right. He was going to make a lane. Oh, fuck. I forgot. There's a... Let me make sure that this picture is safe for work because I don't know um what to expect with this one second now that you remind me apparently he wants to make elaine his um his number two like his co-host which i'm all for i think that would be a great addition <laughs> i think that's a great that's a wonderful idea actually um for, okay hold on. i'm pulling this up you know how the forum is um so these pictures got posted by Godwinson. It's been so long since I've talked about Godwinson. There's a good chance that the majority of people listening to this don't know who he is. So in brief, back in the day, in the primitive dawn of the sector, which would be, it's dead now, but it includes Ethan Ralph and a bunch of A-logs around him. Godwinson was one of the weirdest in, in the sector. He was British. His family is wealthy. Um, he was also like the cleanest and kind of like the most well put together of them. He was young, um, kind of like high energy, uh, funny. He had, he had like his own inventive way of, of talking and, and putting on a show and would always, he had very strict rules for how streams should be done. He called it the Kino dogma of 2007 which is like a cinema reference that like the, he could only create videos in a way that was compliant with like how people did YouTube videos in 2007. So he would always like record with his phone or some shit. Um, anyways, so he was like a weirdo and he would a log the fuck out of Ralph. He always switches sides and does weird shit. And he also hates me and calls me a pedophile constantly. Uh, but at some point he got interested in a lane Elaine, oh my God, if I was in her, if I try to explain all of this, I will never finish the stream. Elaine was, Elaine got, in, oh, oh my God, this is such a fucked up story. I can't believe, okay, trying to explain this. Elaine had a thread on Lolcal Farm, which is an image board. Uh, this is, this is true. I, I don't think a lot of people even know any of this, so I'll just explain it. I don't I don't talk about these people 
But now it's it's becoming more and more unavoidable because Elaine has somehow managed to get Ralph to make her um, uh, co-host, and Godwinson has fucked her or get, allowed her to give him a blowjob, depending on the story. So just to summarize this, Elaine had a thread on Local Farm, an anonymous image board for women to shit talk women. She had an Instagram account where she would post pictures of herself holding bougie shit, talking about how rich she was and how famous she was. And this was very peculiar behavior, so the women of Local Farm made fun of her, as women do. Elaine threatened the host of Local Farm. However, Elaine is not good at computers, so she got mixed up and sent an email to me, the admin of the Kiwi Farms, demanding that I delete her thread on Local Farm, not understanding that I, have, I don't run Local Farm. So as a result of this, she becomes belligerent, and I end up basically porting her Kiwi Farms or her Local Farm thread to Kiwi Farms. I'm the author of her post for this reason because she directly sent me an email about herself. Um, she then becomes a member of the forum. She falsely alleges that she's underage and that there are pictures of her of being underage on the site. There are not. Um, and then she decides that she's not going to take the, this sitting down and tries to uh, get the Kiwi Farms in trouble, starts complaining to hosts. At some point, she meets up with Vordrak, who was one of the first people to try to start the platform in the Kiwi Farms to try and solicit his help in taking us down or something. I don't know. There's a picture of them together. And then um, she declares herself the troll cow because she's not a lol cow. She's a troll. She's a lol cow that trolls back. So she's a troll cow. That's like the official logic behind her username, troll cow now. She, but she um is I, I believe she's low IQ. And so when these people realize that there's a woman who's intimately involved in the Kiwi Farms troll troll saga, uh, she gets corralled into this off-site Discord. And I swear to God, there's a guy who is trolling her, telling her that sh sh that he is me and that we're having a secret relationship. And he asks her to cut my name into her thighs and then tries to goad her into flying out to Belgrade to meet me. I have never spoken to her directly after our original email change. Uh, everything that I've ever said about her has been public. Um, this all gets published online. Uh, she denies that it's her. She's claimed variously that it wasn't her, that it's AI generated, that it's a, an actress that she paid. And then she, I think she's recently admitted that it's her. There's also PP tapes of this. Um, and at some point she hooks up with Godwinson. Here they are together. And Godwinson says that she was only allowed to give him a blow job. Um, and that he would never have sex with her. And now, um, she's going to Mexico to live with Ralph. Eventually, that's the next chapter. That hasn't happened yet. I'm just letting you know what's going to happen. She's going to go to Mexico and live with Ralph. Because if that happens, then I can't help but talk about her because then she'll be intertwined with Ralph, who, of course, I will talk about regardless of what happens. Um, so that's how that works. I think I've avoided talking about this for years because I'm involved and I've always believed that she's a danger to herself and others. And if she were to like do something to hurt herself, I want to make sure that my hands are as clean of this mess as humanly fucking possible. Um, something that I just can't avoid if she were to live in Mexico with Ethan Ralph and uh, maybe also bear his children. Then I would have to talk about her. That would be the only way she could force me to talk about her. So I'm just letting you guys know uh, how that works, um, what this is, and what the fuck is happening. Because uh, I've I think I've avoided this for a very long time. Uh... It's a real woman, yes. Yeah, no, that's her, no, that's Elaine. She's a woman. Uh, it's, I, it's kind of funny because I talk, I try to talk about things that are like really funny that I can laugh with. There's a lot of crazy shit that happens on the forum that I just don't talk about because I don't want to give attention to. You only know these stories if you actually post on the Kiwi forums. Wink, wink, hint, hint, nudge, nudge. Uh, there are some topics I simply don't get into because it's just not um. It's just not a good idea <laughs> most of the time. Just not a good idea. She currently claims to, she also, she like lies a lot about her ancestry. She claims that she's like a, a billionaire from Israel when she's just like some British woman. 
and now she's claiming that she lives in in moscow because uh she really i she knows that okay this is oh god it sounds it sounds so fucking weird when i say it sounds like i'm telling a joke she fervently denies being british because i hate british people and therefore if i hate british people and she's british then i hate her but she doesn't want me to hate her so therefore she's jewish and or russian because i variously at times said i love israel and also i'm an obvious slava boo and i love uh, Eastern European shit. So therefore, uh, she's from Israeli aristocracy and she lives in Moscow because she's half Russian Jewish or some shit. That's how it works. Save her. Not a fucking chance. I just want to let you know. I don't talk to her. I'll never talk to her. Not going to fucking happen. Don't even joke about it. I'm forbidding you chat to even fucking joke about it. I don't want to hear it. Not even as a fucking joke. All right. Um, and that's the Ralph stuff. Uh, Ralph is off the wagon, uh, Elaine. And, and what's really weird is that Godwinson is like such a disappointment because it used to be like, so aloof. It was weird. Cause nobody could like, like could, could, could fuck with him because he, uh, was so out of it. Like, so like he obviously just saw all the arguing online shit as like a, a spectator sport that he was a part of. And now he's like sticking his dick into it, literally sticking his dick into, uh, like a fucking lunatic. <laughs> it's like, have you lost your fucking mind? Why are you doing this? I don't know what's wrong with him. I heard that he's like addicted to crack or some shit. I can believe that his behavior is best explained by crack cocaine. Thank you for watching this clip by Colonel J. This is the King of Bold here. Remember to like and subscribe. Juice.